A common misconception that most people have about boundaries is that they're these binary things. Yes, no, you cross this, you're done. You, you know, like you have to set these like huge hard firm boundaries and actually boundaries are a little bit more nuanced than that. Yes, absolutely hold them, but rather than these hard yes or no things, they're kind of more like, um, for my nerd friends uh, and Lord of the Rings fans, like the city of Minas Tirith, if you've ever seen the movies where it has that like, you know, circle and then another circle and then another circle, that's what boundaries are like. You see, you get the choice to say, okay, here's my boundary for this outermost circle. If you can respect that boundary, then I'll let you into this next circle. Okay, cool. I can see you're doing well with that next boundary. All right, come on into the inner circle. And through those boundaries, you get to determine who gets to the inner circle, who gets to really be in your most inner center. So hope that helps with understanding and setting boundaries in a little bit different way because they don't have to be these big, scary, intimidating things. You can keep somebody here. You can keep somebody here. You can keep somebody here. You can keep somebody on the outermost circle and just love them for who they are at arm's distance, but not really have to let them in. Or if they reward your trust by being trustworthy, if they reward your trust by honoring those boundaries, then you can start letting them in closer and closer and closer. And that's where it's gonna to start to feel a lot better and a lot easier to hold those boundaries. And you're still gonna have some boundaries here too. You're still gonna have some boundaries that, hey, sorry, if you cross this, we're still not gonna work and we have to boot you back out to the outer circle. But that just kind of makes it easier, doesn't it? You know, it doesn't make it this big scary thing like, well, I have to set boundaries and I have to be in my villain era. Um, you can set nuanced boundaries, you can set levels and you can give different people different passwords to those inner levels once they have proven that they can respect even your most entry level boundary. Like, hey, if you don't respect me, I'm sorry, I'm keeping you on the outer circle. If you don't show up to your appointments, I'm sorry, I'm keeping you on this outer circle. Okay, cool. You keep your word, you keep your appointments. Cool, come on in and let me share this level with you and so on and so forth. So with that, happy boundary setting and happy healing.